Have you ever wanted to go to the shrine of Our Lady of Guadalupe to see the tilma that St. Juan Diego wore when he brought up those roses and then threw them down before the bishop and there was the miraculous image of Our Lady of Guadalupe. I was able to go down to Mexico City a year ago and see Our Lady of Guadalupe and was completely overwhelmed. I've been to Rome, I've seen the Shroud of Turin, but for some reason seeing the image of Our Lady of Guadalupe completely overwhelmed me. It was a very emotional experience, very spiritual. When I laid eyes on her for the first time, uh, my eyes filled with tears and I spent hours just sitting there in front of Our Lady of Guadalupe and I thought more people need to experience this. So the new St. Thomas Institute has partnered with 206 Tours and we're creating a pilgrimage that I'd like you to come along with us. Um, my concern initially going to Mexico was, is it safe? Am I going to have safe drinking water? What about the food? How does all this work? And fortunately, 206 Tours has done this pilgrimage so many times um, and they provide coaches, I mean, big buses, great hotels, great food, clean water, clean drink. I literally felt completely safe and like I was in a, a first world country with all the amenities that I needed. And most importantly, I was able to spend time with Our Lady and touring the sacred sites in Mexico City and around there. So we're going back. I'd like to invite you to come along. It's going to be a unique pilgrimage because we're not just going to see the sites and have mass at the sites and pray and have priests and confessions and spiritual direction. But I'm also going to be teaching Catholic classes on theology and apologetics as it relates to the Blessed Virgin Mary. So I'll be teaching a class on Our Lady of Guadalupe, the history and theology of Our Lady of Guadalupe. I'll teach another class on the history of Mariology, Marian doctrine, Marian dogma, over a 2,000 year period. I'll teach a Catholic class on how you can share the truth, the Catholic truth about Mary with your Protestant friends and family. And then I'll also be teaching a class on Mary's mediation. How is it that Mary is mediatrix? And how does her mediation relate to the seven sacraments that we receive in the Catholic Church? So it'll be a pilgrimage, but you'll also be, as we, as we drive around and we're in the coaches in the evenings, we'll be talking about theology and we'll be learning and we'll be opening up our hearts and our minds to Our Lady, not just through the image there at Our Lady of Guadalupe, but also engaging with her in a prayerful way and in a theological way. So I'm going to take a, a stop here. I'm going to go through the itinerary so you can see what we're going to do on our pilgrimage, and then I'm going to tell you how you can get involved in it. So let's take a look. All right, so when we arrive in Mexico City, there's going to be someone there to greet you. We'll have a tour guide there. We'll gather our bags, and we will head to our hotel. It's going to be a wonderful hotel. We'll have dinner and a welcome, and I'll be there, and maybe we'll have some opening words, and we'll talk about Our Lady of Guadalupe and what we're going to see. The next morning, we're going to go to the Shrine of Our Lady of Guadalupe, the star of the new evangelization, patroness of the Americans. And we'll see the plaza of the three cultures. We'll go to the original shrine. We'll go to the new shrine. And we'll see the hill where Our Lady appeared to Juan Diego. And we will see the entire complex. There's quite a bit to see there. And we'll have professional tour guides with us. And I'll be saying some things and sharing some remarks as well. Um, and we'll have great meals and maybe see some of the local markets and give you an opportunity to buy uh, souvenirs and sacramentals for your friends and family back home. The next day we'll go into Mexico City and we will see the tomb of uh, Father Miguel Pro, the Jesuit martyr during the Mexican Revolution. We'll learn some about the Mexican Revolution. We'll also go to the Metropolitan Cathedral, which is absolutely stunning. You'll feel like you walked into a cathedral somewhere in Europe. We'll see some other churches and some shrines. The next day we will head out and we'll see the place where St. Michael the Archangel appeared to Diego Lazaro in 1631. It's a small shrine, it's an intimate shrine, but it is a highlight and I think you'll love to see this and learn about St. Michael and his miracle there. And there's a chance also to get the um, holy water that comes from a spring that was sprung by St. Michael. So we'll be able to experience that and you'll be able to bring that water home. Uh, with you from your pilgrimage. It's a little known thing that a lot of people who go to Mexico City don't know, but this is one of the special things that we'll be able to do that you'll be able to experience. Then the next day we will uh, return to the Shrine of Our Lady of Guadalupe. We'll have a Mass there 
and you'll have time to pray and reflect and see her and you know pray for all the intentions of your family and friends that they they sent with you um, there in the shrine to be with Our Lady. I know when I was there, I didn't want to leave. I just wanted to stay and see Our Lady because it truly is moving. You can, of course, go on the conveyor belt below to see her very close, but I actually prefer to be out in the nave, in the pews, just looking at the tilma and seeing her. We'll visit some more churches as well, and you'll have plenty of time to buy sacramentals, to get anything you need for people back home. I, I know you'll want to do that and maybe get one of the official images, a copy replica of Our Lady of Guadalupe. And then the next day we'll have a great breakfast and a farewell, and we will head back to our cities, and I'm sure you'll meet a lot of friends. If you're in the New St. Thomas Institute, you'll meet a lot of other Muskoxen, members of the New St. Thomas Institute. And along the way, we'll be studying. So there's the itinerary. I'm gonna put a link below this video. And if you click on that link, you'll see a page where you can see a map of where we're going. You can see the itinerary. You can learn more about this pilgrimage that is educational. It's a New St. Thomas Institute pilgrimage where you're learning Catholic theology, Catholic apologetics, and you're on a pilgrimage. So click on the link, check it out, reserve your spot, please. We're going to have a limited number due to the size of the coach, the bus that we'll be on. But I'd love for you to be there. I'd love for the members of the New St. Thomas Institute to be there. And if you are a member of the New St. Thomas Institute, there'll be a coupon code um, where you'll be able to save $100. Just type in NSTI when you go to this page, and that will give you a discount for this pilgrimage as a thank you for being a part of the New St. Thomas Institute. So I hope you sign up. I hope I get to spend a few days with you eating, laughing, having fun, praying together, going to Mass together, and it'll be a good time. It'll be a holy time. So thanks so much, and we'll see you on the pilgrimage. Bye now.